Welcome to Kingdom Warfare Channel. Where God teaches your hands to war and your fingers to fight. God bless you as you subscribe to this channel. Amen. Shout it loud, hallelujah. A louder, hallelujah. Let's have the two hands as we sing this song loud and clear. Jehovah, you are so good in my life. Jehovah, you are so, you are so good. Jehovah, you are so good in my life. Jehovah.
Thank you, Jesus. Father, we thank you for another time before your feet. Thank you because it is written. Secret things belong unto the Lord our God. But those things which are revealed are revealed unto us and our children. Father, we thank you because it is written. That oppression shall be far from your people. Accept our thanks in Jesus' name. And that lay your hands upon us today. Let us war a good warfare. In Jesus' mighty name we pray. Let's have a seat. God bless you. Let me say right away. But if you are allergic to hard praying, you are not going to enjoy this morning service. If you are allergic to prayer, you will end today's service. For what we are dealing with, it's a very serious matter indeed. Information downloaded from heaven. Can you raise up your right hand and shout as loud as your voice can carry you? Say, evil arrows. Backfire! In the name of Jesus. Open your mouth and pray it. In Jesus' name we pray. Now let me decode for you this popular mountain of fire and miracles ministry prayer point. Every prayer we pray in mountain of fire and miracles ministry always has a scriptural base. We don't pray on scriptural prayers. I'm taking you through six of scripture. So you can know how to position yourself on a morning like this. We're not here to play. We're not here to joke. We're here for serious business. In Psalm 7,
verse 16. I did not write the scriptures. And it wasn't the mountain of fire and miracles that I wrote it. Psalm 7 verse 16. Is chief shall return upon his own head and his violent dealing shall come down upon his path. Path their head. Go back to the book of Nehemiah. Nehemiah chapter 4. This is a prayer point. Prayed by Nehemiah. Nehemiah 4 4. Hear our God. For we are despised. And turn their reproach upon their own head and give them for a prey in the land of captivity. Psalm 9 verse 15 Psalm 9 verse 15 the heathen has sunk down in the pit that they made. They made the pit. They go inside themselves. In the night which they hid is their own food taken. Psalm 35, verse 8. That over there. All the powers that have conspired that you will not have peace. By the time you leave this service, they shall be scattered unto desolation. Psalm 35 was 8. Psalm 35 was 8. Let destruction come upon him at unawares. And let his net that he had hid catch himself into that very destruction let him fall I did not write it but there it is Psalm 70 verse 2 and 3 Psalm 70 2 and 3 let be ashamed and confounded the sick after my soul. Let them be turned backward and put to confusion that desire my heart. Let them be turned back for the word of their shame that are saying, aha, aha. And in Psalm 109, which is the sixth, sixth one I'm going to read. Psalm 109, verse 17. 109, verse 7. As a loved cousin, so let it come unto him. As a delight, let not him blessing. 
so let it be far from him. These are just six of many scriptures showing you that the believer has a right to pick any issued against him to pick any incantation issued against him to pick any utterance issued against him to pick any arrow issued against him and ask it to go back to the senders that's, those are the scriptures that are telling us we can do that when a person is so wicked and disobedient to God and is flinging witchcraft arrows in Cartesian against a child of God they must be stopped you have to stop them before they stop you if you do not stop them they will stop you it has been well written that the best defense is attack when you return a curse and arrow back to you are not committing any sin because you did not initiate the arrow you did not initiate the curse you are merely sending it back to the originator when we return those curses to the senders they now know that there is a power that is greater than their own powers this is a very serious matter it was in the whole town of Akure that was a brother John a converted Muslim who took evangelism very seriously 5 a.m. he was up with a bell going around the streets saying repent but the kingdom of God is at hand the drunker repent adulterer repent 5 a.m. in the morning but during his journey he passes through occultic places he was just preaching the gospel <laughs> He didn't know he was harming the occultic people. He just is crossing the place and talking. If, if some of you know how darkness fear you, <laughs> you'll be more serious with your Christianity. The Bible says, resist the devil. He will flee. He will flee. Oh, uh, so the devil can run away from somebody. Place, yes, it's in the Bible. Say so resisting, resisted. Flee. If he's not fleeing, check the resistance you are putting up. You are, you are either not resisting or your resistance is weak or your resistance is tainted with sin. Flee. So thou believers there is one God thou doest well. See, the demons also believe and they tremble. So, the enemies do tremble. Powers of darkness do tremble when they see their match. I'm praying for somebody here this morning. The anointing to terrify your enemies. Receive that anointing in the name of Jesus. A seven fold amen. But like John did not know that it was troubling them. So they gathered the major native doctors to kill him. 
to use their weapon. That they used to kill people to kill him. And the greatest weapon is a drum. A satanic drum. After days and days and days of sacrifice, they brought the drum. It had never happened. They will begin to conjure the spirit, the soul of a person to appear on that drum. If any preacher is telling you <laughs> that there is no power of darkness, it's just deceiving you. There is power of darkness. Jesus admitted that there is power of darkness. So I give you power to tread upon serpents and scorpions and over every power of the enemy. The enemy has power. If the enemy has no power, the magic pharaoh, <laughs> with which power did they turn their own stick to serpent? There is power, dark powers. So they call the person, they call the person, they conjure the person. And very soon, the face will appear on the drum. Then they will stick a knife through it. And the person bleeds to death. It has never failed them. This day, they gathered against Brajon. May every enemy gathered against you be disgraced in the name of Jesus. They call his name the first time. Nobody appeared. They call him the second time. Nobody appeared. And they only have three opportunities to call it. They call him the third time. The face of Brother John appeared. They took the to hit it on the drum and pierce the drum. Just a split second, split second, for that knife to touch the drum. The face here, the face of the man with the knife. And he couldn't stop himself anymore. It ran the knife through. It landed on the floor, bleeding. And the others started incantations to revive him. I'm praying right that any arrow fired against your life, fired against your children, fired against your career, fired against. Backfire, 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 the, the university, study mathematics, just went blind in the classroom. No reason. She didn't have any high problem. So they began to take her from place to place, from place to place. Everywhere they went to check her brain, check her eyes, the doctor said, there is no problem with these eyes. There is no reason why these eyes are not seen. No, but more, don't more. They be no last. They come lost you, mirror. No, but that is here. You want to go to school? Go go to school. They pay low to you. Then the mother brought her here. Neighbor, to you, neighbor, but I'm wasi are you one? I've grown beyond that now. If it's, if, it, if, it's, if, it's, if it's now, I will not do what I did. Like. Everybody grows in Christ every day. Grown beyond that. Even when they came in, I had the voice of the Holy Spirit. 
so the agent of blindness is here. So, oh. okay. Madam, do you know anything about what happened to your daughter? No, no sir. Please pray. Please pray. No, no sir. It's okay. We had a small toilet at the back of this place. That's okay. Mommy. Mama. Go inside that room. Daughter. Go inside that room. Both of you, you are going to start praying. Serious prayer. Let your voices roar like thunder in that place. They said, anything you ask us to do, sir, we shall do. They started prayer. What was the prayer point I gave to them? Every evil arrow. Go back to your sender. Sir. Every evil arrow. Go back to your sender. Daughter was shouting. Daughter was shouting. Mother was shouting the prayers. It went on for 15 minutes. All of a sudden, we were not hearing the voice of mother again was only the girl shouting. By the time we opened the door, daughter can now see. Mother was now blind. It was finished. When they were coming, mother took daughter by the hand and was dragging her like this. When they finish, was daughter dragging my mother. I'm praying for you. Any arrow fired against you, conscious or unconscious, in the dream, in the physical, whether you know about it, don't know about it, let those arrows backfire now in the name. Amen. Amen. Thank you, Jesus. Some people complain. Why are you people praying against enemies? If it is wrong to pray against an enemy that wants you dead, that wishes evil for you, then David shouldn't have killed Goliath. Abraham shouldn't have defended his nephew, Lot. God will not have sent Moses to go and deliver his people from Egypt. If you don't have to fight your enemies. In fact, there will not even be any need for Nigeria to be fighting Boko Haram. Love your enemies like yourself. Oh, go to Sambisa Forest and love them. <laughs> there will be no need to fight them. We should have allowed a man to just hang Mordecai like that. David should not have been fighting all the enemies of Israel. Elijah should not have been praying that God should send fire upon his enemies. The Bible says the weapons of our warfare are not carnal. But the mighty true God to the pulling down of strongholds, casting down every imagination and every eye thing that exhausts itself against the knowledge of God. Why should Elijah pray that God should strike his enemy with blindness? Why did Daniel pray against those enemies that falsely accuse him to be thrown into the lion's den? This is a very, very serious matter. Very serious matter. There are arrows, the enemies, they are firing now. And this is the cross of the prayer meeting of this month. Arrows of disfavor. Arrows of failure. 
arrows of unexplained arrows of academic and career frustration arrows of almost dear syndrome almost dear arrows of joblessness untimely death these days they fire arrows of vagabond life into children who are already in the university they just come home and say I'm not studying again arrows of poverty arrows of building but not living therein arrows of marital distress arrows of suicidal tendencies arrows of addictions For, as a matter of fact the enemy has now bombarded the whole world with arrows of drug addiction many young people including ladies are becoming addicted to hard drugs arrows of gynecological problems arrows of confusion arrows of chain problems arrows of being disgraced out of breakthrough arrows of infirmities arrows of demotion arrows of hardship arrows of promotion failure arrows of frustration arrows of dream oppression arrows of paralysis arrows of business failure arrows of strange women into marriages arrows of debts arrows of prayer paralysis arrows of dead organs in the body the enemy is firing these arrows all over the place arrows of profit starvation into business arrows of rejection arrows of polygamy arrows of night feeding arrows of closed doors arrows of fruitless efforts arrows of pocket with holes people wake up or they are not even awake and they find that they are being choked on their bed arrows are entered some hearing voices people calling their names they don't know it's... the arrow, the arrows the arrows have entered sudden depression comes upon a happy person it's arrows have entered some just fear needlessly are... we've seen many people at deliverance ground they said a wind blew upon them and they lost the use of the hand and the leg arrows of heavy head arrows of feeling cold in a hot room arrows of sending physical idols to people arrows of calling people's name at night from the sleep all upon every day we to keep quiet leave them alone it's a close destiny unfortunately prayers have to be specific general prayers don't work. They have to be specific what you are really attacking. So this morning, you need to surrender your life to Jesus. That's the first important thing. Without that, the backfiring prayers will not be of help. You need to become a friend of God. So you smoke, you drink, commit fornication, you lie, you cheat you have not yet surrendered the life to Jesus 
spirit to know. I want you to benefit from the prayers of today. So wherever you are, why all eyes are closed? Say, Pastor, I want to surrender my life to Jesus. Let's find a way to the altar here very quickly. Jesus is waiting for you here. The Lord of us has brought you here to bless you. So find a way to this altar. In the name of Jesus, I come before you now, Lord Jesus, come into my life, take control of my life, in Jesus' name, amen. I'm going to pray with you now. Father, children, keep them standing by your power. Write their names in the book of life. Let the decision they've taken today be permanent in their lives. In Jesus' name we pray. Open your eyes and look at me. You've taken the most important decision in life. And see, this, see this pastor over there. Just follow the pastor. Just follow the pastor for a few minutes. God bless you as you do so. Thank you. On the mountain, in the valley, on the land, and in the sea, on the mountain, the on the land and in the sea. Hallelujah. The Lord is my portion in the land of the living. The Lord is good forevermore. The Lord is my portion in the land of the living. The Lord is good forevermore. Now praise the Lord. What is to be praised, O Lord? What is to be praised, O Lord? What is to be praised, O Lord? You are my Oh, yeah, oh, I'm not 
somebody. I don't know who the persons are. And you don't know which one is relevant to your case. Because in the spiritual realm, what you see is not sometimes what you fight. All eyes closed. Can you shout this louder than anyone around you? Every killer disease against me backfire in the name of Jesus somebody is breaking through I told you Receive your healing. Receive your healing. Receive your healing. That is the power of God coming upon you. Yes. In Jesus' name we pray. Don't worry about the wordings of this prayer. Pray them the way I'm calling them. Say, strange odor. From the grave against me. Can you shout it loud? Backfire! In the name of Jesus. You my power with the enemy this morning. We are not here to negotiate. Yes. Yes. In Jesus' name. I was praying with somebody recently. <laughs> and the demon spoke. The demon said, Man of God. When you asked me to leave this person, I left. Because a lot of punishment when I came to MFM. So I, I left this person. But the parents began to offer sacrifices, sacrifices, sacrifices to send me back. Yeah, it's a different work. But some people began to offer the demon sacrifice to go back. Can you shout it loud and clear? Dangerous sacrifices. Offer the God. Can you shout it loud? Your voice is not loud enough. Backfire. In the name of Jesus. Please, sir, please, sir, please, sir, please, sir, please, sir, please. See that woman? Yes, yes, yes. In Jesus' name, we pray. See what is going on. Yes. 
Jesus that have gained access into my blood. Can you shout it loud? You are a liar! Backfire! In the name of Jesus. Raise your voice. Raise your voice. Raise your voice. Raise your voice. Bapoka Tarabo. Rida Kayabo Shatayabo Sanda. In Jesus' name we pray. Shout this loud. Say, Arrows of the night. Backfire. In the name of Jesus. This is right now. In Jesus' name we pray. I sign to frustrate my efforts. Can you say it loud and clear? Backfire! In the name of Jesus. Today is today. Enough is enough. You cannot negotiate. In Jesus' name we pray. Say, arrows. Assign experience the battles of my parents. This prayer is going to cause great deliverance now. Assigned to make me experience of my parents. Backfire in the name of Jesus. See that brother is breaking through. See that sister is breaking through. It's breaking through. In Jesus' name we pray. I want you to lose your temper completely. And pray with violent anger in this particular three prayer points. With the massive presence of angels of God moving about here. Arrows are signed to drag me backwards. You are a liar. Backfire. In the name of Jesus. You shall not drag me backward. You cannot drag me backward. Yes. Yes. In Jesus' name we pray. Out. Fire to block my joy. Can you shout it loud? There is a sister who needs to shout this loud. Back fire, name of Jesus.
Aha! Continue, continue. Something is happening to you. Continue, continue. In Jesus' name we pray. Allows assigned to make me labor in vain. Can I hear the brothers shouting it? Brothers, I think your voice should be louder. Let me hear the sisters roaring like thunder. Go back in the name of Jesus. Jesus. In Jesus' name we pray. Say, arrows! I don't shoot down my star. There is a young man who needs to shout this prayer loud. There is a parent who needs to shout this loud. name we pray. Charm. Sent against me. Can you say it with authority? Can you allow your voice to be loud? You are a Lord. Back in the name of Jesus. Today is today. You cannot negotiate. This is not a day to negotiate. Makate koshenda rabo senta. Ribo sapo le katende ke ya boko shenta raba. Thank you, Jesus. In Jesus' name, we pray. Next one is a very critical and important arrow that must go back to the senders. Please, I'm begging you. If you lose your voice, bring this one. But you get a breakthrough, you have made a good bargain. Arrows of envious enemies. Jesus today is today you cannot negotiate yes 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 makatende ke ya boshendera bosotola kaya boshanga name we pray. Let there be silence now. Perfect silence. Don't say anything. Not even say amen. 
every demonic missile fired against his brother every demonic missile fired against his sister and her children right there when let the arrows begin to go back to their senders arrows of eaters of flesh and drink you have made a huge mistake whether they call you cancer whatever name they call you go back to your senders it is happening the arrow of strange women in your marriage is going back to the senders All the agents of darkness that have been sent to carry messages against you. To carry their messages back to their senders. And release their arrows they brought against you to them. All the arrows of the wicked elders and from witchcraft altars fired against 21 persons here go back to your center that's number one two three four five six seven eight nine ten you can't hide eleven twelve thirteen 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21. That brother, listen, the evil words spoken against your life shall not stay. But shall go back in the name of Jesus. A seven fold man. Thanks for watching. I believe you have been richly blessed. Please remember to subscribe to this channel. Like and press the notification button. God bless you as you remain blessed. Amen.